Hi, I'm Randy Brown, your YRA year on athlete instructor. Today's lesson is turning a double play on a ball hit to your right, fielding the ball backhanded. There's six key points. Number one, get in an athletic ready position. Number two, your route and angle to the baseball. Number three, your footwork to field the baseball. Number four, field the baseball backhanded. Number five, your transition into your throw. And finally, in point number six, make a good throw to the second baseman. So let's go back to point number one, the athletic ready position. There's two options here. One, you creep step right left into the ready position. So as the pitcher delivers the ball, right left. Knees are bent, chest over your knees, elbows in, glove up. Or you can hop into it. What this does, it allows you to break on the ball quickly once the ball is hit in a given direction. And point number two, the route and angle to the baseball. So once the ball is hit, it's hit to our right. The speed and the hop are the key indicators to how we're gonna field this baseball, how we set up our footwork, and how we field it glove work wise. So once the ball is hit to my right, you wanna make sure you stay low, you read the hop, you judge the speed of the hop, then you can go into your footwork to field the baseball, which brings me to point number three. There's two options here. One, I can play this ball into a backhand, or if the ball is extending me out, it'll carry me into the backhand. So the first one, I'm gonna show you the footwork on playing a ball into a backhand. So the ball is hit to my right. As I move, I'm going to go right, left, right, left, all right? And so what that will do, that'll set my footwork up towards second base. So as I play this ball, I wanna present right, left, right, left. Now my momentum's going towards second base. The second one is where the ball extends me. It's gonna be left, right, left. So as I'm moving to the ball, left, right, left. Now the glove will be out in front of my glove foot, which is my left foot, and the ball is taking me towards the line. Which brings me into number four, point number four, fielding the baseball. So when I'm playing this ball into a backhand, as I'm going right, left, right, left when I feel that baseball I'm feeling the ball backhanded right off the inside part of my back leg if I feel the ball where it extends me towards the line it's going to be left right left left right left and notice how when I feel the ball my glove is out over my front foot which brings me to point number five my transition into your throw you always have to make sure your legs are under you to make a strong throw so when I play this ball into a backhand, I'm moving to the ball. As I feel the ball, I want to secure it in my hand, get it to my chest as quickly as I can. And as I shuffle towards second base, my direction is dead on towards second base. Okay, now I'm ready to make a strong throw. If the ball extends me into a backhand, I'm going to continue my momentum. I'm going to stop. I can throw from here or I can take a shuffle and throw from here. The two differences in, in the throw, when I'm moving towards second base, I wanna throw from a three quarter arm slot, which brings me to point number six. When I'm playing a ball into a backhand and I'm moving in this direction, I wanna throw from a three quarter arm slot. If the ball extends me, now I gotta make a stronger throw. Now it's okay to throw over the top. So at the end of the day, we gotta make a good throw towards the second baseman so he can make a quick turn to, to complete the double play. So I'm gonna give you a couple examples here. And I'm walking it out. Always follow your throw. Plant, throw, follow your throw. So remember these six points. Number one, get in an athletic ready position. Number two, your route and angle to the baseball. Number three, your footwork to field the baseball. Number four, field the baseball backhanded. Number five, your transition into your throw. And finally, in point number six, make a good throw to the second baseman. That's turning a double play on a ball hit to your right, fielding the ball backhanded.